Cobras. Number one contenders match here is Royal Apocalypse faces the Silver Saints. Tag team action in the Frontier Pro Wrestling Tag Team Division is heating up, El Marco. And these are both teams that we have seen, studied. Well, you a little bit more with one team than the other. Especially, yes. I mean, Royal Apocalypse, I mean, everybody knows I have a little connection to these gentlemen. Unfortunately, Joey P couldn't be here today. He's out on the trash route. Don't ask. And, and Lucius and, and Phil Insane are going to handle business here against the Rope to Rope Tag Team Champions, the Silver Saints. They are our new champs just winning them, what, two weeks ago in uh, Binghamton. So congratulations to them as they are uh, looking to add to their collection and take that NEPA Cup Championship home with them. Oh, these two are not to be uh, taken lightly, even though <laughs> they're definitely at a size disadvantage here. Yes, but they, they have their quickness and and they have a determination. That's why they were right. They're, they're like, like little Rottweilers or little uh, Chihuahuas, I, I guess. Say, they little just, Chihuahuas yes. nipping at your leg. Oh, the crow now just dominating. <laughs> Oh, Kyra breaks that up. It, it don't look like it right now, but I guarantee you Maxwell Keith is happy that Crow is in there. Because nobody wants to be in there with Phil and Sink. No. The name fits. We see what he did at the last convention show. Like he tried to take on the entire audience. Phil and Sane makes me look like a teddy bear. I got no clue. Well, uh, no! Since we're, we're near it, we're build a bear! Okay, yeah. <laughs> build a skeleton. <laughs> oh, here we go. The oh! Hey. Big rolling sense on from Maxwell Keith off of the road. I don't believe I've ever seen Maxwell Keith hit that move before. I've never either. And I, I'm kind of. <laughs> and I can, give me a minute to put my jaw Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean. exactly. And, it's, I gotta say, it's been impressive to see these two kids. I, I, I was there for their first match against each other in, in Binghamton. And to be able to watch them progress over the last a year and a half to really becoming a fine-tuned team. Well, we've discussed before that these two fighting each other has actually helped when it comes to chemistry in the tag team. Yes, they yes. They know each other. Exactly, almost like a sixth sense. But speaking of sixth sense, mine's tingling right now because there's a oh, maniac yeah. in the ring. Yeah. I don't want to 
think this poor fly is going to get squashed here. Uh, it's going to be bad. The, I mean, Cairo is the Egyptian god, but he is in there with an absolute monster. Oh, and that chop and then just a, um, a forearm shot right to the face. I, I mean, I know I know Maxwell is the, the, the lord of the flies or whatever. But, the lord of the flyweights. But both, both of these guys look like flies compared to Phil. Yeah, definitely right off. Oh, I mean, just straight right hands to the face. It's a mugging when you're in there with Phil Insane. Look at him. Oh, but... Cairo just grabbing the hair, trying to do anything he can to get out of this headlock. It's not even a normal headlock when this man has you locked up. He can literally pop your no, blood vessel. It's a... Well, I don't want to say anaconda grip, but it's... It might as well, yeah. It's like, it's like having a... a let's say the, uh, the creature from... Uh, oh, I can't think of it. Chitaru or whatever. It lives down in the sea. The, 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 the no, octopus. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay Kraken. Kraken. There you go. It's like having a Kraken grab a hold of your head. Sorry, I know that because I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> oh, ladies and gentlemen, the one and only El Marco. Kraken Alcohol, please sponsor us. Yes. Message us on Smart Mark Alley on Facebook. <laughs> we take free samples. <laughs> Oh, but now, and, and look at this. He's just driving his face into the mat while choking. Yes. Like, it's, it's unbelievable. I guarantee you, no man wants to step in the ring and feel insane. So, trying to motivate his to get up there. I was starting to fight back. Really should have put a tag there. Oh, but look, Crow tagged himself Tag in. in. Hell. Oh, I, don't, oh. I don't think Cairo saw it. Oh, but if he gets to Maxwell. Maxwell, that spinning heel kick. Another. Three makes it to third. That's insane. Insane, don't even feel it. They just keep crushing it off. Oh, oh they got him down. Tag team the here. We've seen him do this before. Double team DDT. Is that a DDT or a face plant? I'm going with DDT. Oh, right. So it was a modified move. Yeah. Oh, Stabber. You class it up. That's what it's <laughs> Two is throw kicks out. Maxwell trying to get Pro to his feet here. Tags in Cairo. Well, these, these two are setting up for something here. It looks like that side Russian leg speed combo we've seen. But Pro pushing Cairo out of the way. Almost took out the ref. That would have been a shame. This guy, he don't deserve that. He's no Matt. We'll say that. He, he, he's always been a fair official in my terms, but oh, now here comes the long kiss goodnight. Bro driving Cairo's face into the mat. Now, oh no, like it couldn't get any worse. What are you doing, bro? You should have pinned him. He wants to hurt him, and now Crow rolling to the outside to take care of Maxwell Keith. Oh, Phil Insane prepares to murder the Christian God. Black hole slam, and it is over. The Royal Apocalypse is your new number one contender. You know my name, that boy? It doesn't matter, you psycho. Hey, how does that work? What, psycho? Not that one, I don't want to talk about. Ah! 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 Ah!